What's up everybody? My name is Jeff and this is my very first video. Um, I've been thinking about doing this for a really long time and uh, yeah, today I'm just gonna be going around to a photo shoot, showing you guys exactly how I do this and uh, create some really cool portraits with my friend Lauren. So what I'm gonna be using today is the Fujifilm GFX 100S. It's a medium format digital camera. So as you can see, the sensor is absolutely giant. There it is. Thing's massive. But today we're gonna to be going around Stratford uh, with my friend Lauren, and we're gonna be taking some portraits. I've actually adapted a Cine Bloom from Moment. This is the 20% diffusion filter. As you can see, it's extremely hazy. So that's gonna add to the whole effect of these like vintage looking portraits that I'm gonna take. Let's go. All right, so I just got Lauren. This is Lauren. Hi. <laughs> looks awesome. It's perfect for this shoot, for this look that we're going for today. So we're gonna hit up a couple different spots downtown and yeah, go see what we can do. All right, so hopping right into this. Uh, we started off on the street corner with some really nice light coming in from the side. Uh, keep in mind, this was at about noon um, with barely any clouds in the sky, so it made for a really harsh lighting situation. Luckily for me, Lauren knows where the sun is and uh, usually does really well with that. Sweet. Awesome. Next, we hopped into this bookshop and uh, got the photo here. Uh, Lauren grabbing the books. Next we went into Diamond Dogs Vinyl, uh, downtown Stratford, and it had this really cool beam of light coming through the window and it kind of picked up all the dust and kind of haze in the air and uh, made for a really cool look. Exactly what I was going for. Switch out to the uh, tighter lens, 63, 2.8. And again, Lauren knows exactly what they're doing, so it makes my life a lot easier. So we went for a little bit of a vintage look with this, uh, with the haze filter and what Lauren's wearing paired really nicely with that vintage film kind of vibe. One thing to note about this camera is it absolutely eats storage. So you have to have cards on hand. Um, I think I went through a 128 and a 64 in this shoe. Um, you fly through the memory just because it's a 102 megapixel camera. And the, uh, the files that come out of this are absolutely massive. see the detail when I zoom in, uh, the detail on the eyes and everything is just incredible. All right, so that's it for this video. I had a really, really good time testing out the Fujifilm GFX 100S, and I just love the way that the colors turn out with the skin tones, blue dress, earrings, stuff like that I think just is unmatched when it comes to a Fuji camera. Typically, I shoot with a Sony, which is what I'm shooting on right now, and I can shoot really fast bursts and capture everything that I think that I wanna capture at the time. When I was using this Fuji camera, I thought it was a little slow. I thought that the shutter just didn't regenerate fast enough for me to shoot again. Um, the autofocus was definitely not on par with Sony's, but again, the colors are unmatched. There's no way to beat those Fuji colors, honestly. And another thing I should mention is I actually use this 20% Cinebloom filter from Moment. This filter is 
very, very hazy, and it actually sort of takes away from the detail of the final image. It looks really cool, and I think I would take the trade, the bloom of the highlights over the detail, but in any case, it just takes away from the detail of the image, so you have to be really careful in the situations when you're using this. All right, so to end this off, I'd like to say thank you to Fujifilm for letting me use their camera, and also thank you to everybody in my life who's actually told me that I should make one of these videos. It was really fun and I actually really enjoyed it. I hope to make a lot more videos like this in the future surrounding photography and videography and just going out on shoots to do stuff that I wanna do. So thanks for watching and I will see you guys very soon.